Joining me now, Lana head coach Nancy Fay and coach. I like the way we came, and uh, we outplayed them in the third quarter, coming out of the locker room in the second half. Unfortunately, as you and I have talked about all season long, you got to play the second and the fourth quarters as well. Yeah, I mean, I think our game plan defensively, we wanted to keep it somewhere in that 60 range. Thought we did that. Um, you know, it's just again we're tr trying to pick up more than 50 points. That's been kind of a sustaining uh, situation for us. Half court uh, defense tonight, I thought that was excellent. Were they, where they got their points were in uh, in transition off missed missed shots. Well, that and the free throw line. Right. Um, those two areas. Uh, you know, we try to get back on D. We had talked about that. Um, you know, just they got a lot of points, free points from that the free throw line, and uh, we did. I mean, to me, that was a difference in the game. When you made your runs, CeCe Rice was a big factor in that 12 points tonight. Talk about her play. You know, CeCe's, you know, gone through a lot, and I thought, you know, as far as, and I think she's starting to develop her, her outside game and having confidence in taking that open shot. I mean, that was one of our points of emphasis this week, and I think we shot the ball for the first time pretty well from three, um, just to take those open looks quicker. I mean, I think sometimes we try to, you know, run, run what I'm asking, and I was trying to emphasize, but they're open, and then reverse will take your open shots, and I thought she reacted to that one. Well, obviously, Harris is a big shot blocker for them, but uh, just a couple shot blocks. I, I thought that our, our game plan to try to attack her, and you know, we knew, I think, when to attack her and when not to. Yeah, I mean, we felt like Alex in that one-on-one, -on -one, that was, she had a good game, Alex, in game one, and they had stayed behind. I don't know, about, I don't know, late in the third or fourth quarter, they started fronting her. And um, so, yeah, we were attacking when we thought that she, she was behind, and I thought that was a good matchup for us. Down by uh, seven with the ball at one point, I believe, late in the game. We cut into what earlier had been a 14-point deficit. So, again, uh, this team keeps charging hard, but uh, come up a little bit short. Well, I, I think that uh, earlier in the year that it stayed at 14 and grew a little bit. You know, we right, kept it, right. but it was growing. Now what's starting to happen is that we're not folding and we're fighting back and getting this. I mean, it's a 13-point loss, but we were falling at the end. And... So that's that's I mean there, there's that's what's something we were trying to make sure we keep fighting and they they're, they're responding well to that. Anything final, one Mike? One game left okay. in the uh, in the regular season. Uh, Kennedy Catnhead going out a senior night. And Allie Ball. Of, and Allie Ball as well. Uh, just talk about the approach these last uh, we kind of not that many practices left in the in the season. You know I think the the approach has been what I just said to them um, today is that you know it's senior, it's it's our last home game. Um, it is different, you know, it is not the same. It's not like any other game and, you know, the ball goes up and we want to go out again and, you know, our idea is to win. That's what we said tonight. It's like we're not out here just to get close and uh, that's our plan on Sunday. Coach, thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you again on Sunday. Sounds good. Fighting Atlanta basketball coach Nancy Fay.